Today's fat file is on the common lizard, reaching lengths of up to 12 centimetres. The other name it's known by is the viviparous lizard, owing to its habit of giving birth to live young, an adaptation to cope with colder climates. It's the most northerly lizard species in the world, being found right up into the Arctic Circle, and widespread across Britain. It's also the only native reptile in Ireland. It's quite variable in colour, from black, brown and green, with mottled markings mixed in. It has slender toes and a long tail which it can detach if a predator grabs it, and eventually regrow. Its pointed head is one difference from its bigger and rarer cousin, the sand lizard, which is more blunt in shape. Male common lizards have bright orange underbellies also. It feeds on small invertebrates, such as beetles, woodlice and worms. It normally hides on the edge of habitats, soaking up the sun. It stays close to dense cover, so it can quickly hide among twigs, logs and leaves. It's found in a wide array of ecosystems, from heathland, wetland, woodland and coastal dunes, being a very adaptable lizard, and sometimes even in gardens. It's distinguishable from newts, being much quicker as newts crawl slowly. Like all British reptiles, they hibernate around October and come back out in the spring, around March. They tend to have favoured basking spots, so will often return to the same spot. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Other fact files are on the screen and new uploads every Monday and Thursday. Also, why not check out my wildlife podcast, the Bearded Tits podcast, where I interview wildlife TV presenters, artists, cameramen and scientists each week. Until next time, cheers.